Hello Manjaro community, Philip Miller here. Let's talk about what is new since week 48 in Manjaro Linux KDE. If you click on Octopi you will see and get notified that we have over 200 updates. So let's talk about how we do that in a smooth way. So first scroll through what is actually been updated. So we have a lot of library rebuilds. We get the latest Plasma. We have the latest Mesa updated as well. Plus, we see here we have Systemd coming up as well. So as you can see here, it is as a low version. And in the same series, we will update a lot of commits. So in this particular case, I will strongly recommend to do that in a terminal. If you use Octopi, most likely it will be fine. But if you have PAMAC or some GDK distributions and using PAMAC, we know we have an issue with uh, the updating. It will freeze a little bit. So for that, I recommend to do it in the terminal as written also in the forums. So if you have VirtualBox, you can simply switch to TTY2 by pressing the host control and F2. If you're on an install system, press control alt F2. So inside of the TTY2, let's start a pacman, sudo pacman hyphen su and press enter, enter your password and it will synchronize the database first. It will tell you first uh, do the k-ring update, after that it will continue to update the full. So you can see here we have to download about 628. As I have a fast connection it will be not taking as much. And after that you should have to reboot your system. I will always keep track on the post transactions to see if something is failing. Also during the upgrading and installing process I will keep a close eye on the upgrade itself. Since no issue is appearing here, we will do a reboot now. So we updated all the kernels to the latest versions. The latest version of PAMAC will fix the freezing issues during update in VirtualBox. We updated Firefox to the latest version. Important security fixes got added to the latest point release of Thunderbird. To get more information what changed in Plasma 14.4, please visit the KDE homepage. Leave your feedback in the comments below and see you soon.